Yeah, I don't know about you, how you feel, but I think it's time to have some fun on this planet. We've been miserable over here way too long. Come on. <laughs> Let's cheer up and have some really good fun for the next uh, two or three thousand years. Okay. You ready for this? Um, the question for this video is, does God have sense of humor? Does God get offended when we do something that is not in alignment? It's like, well, here is, yeah, yeah, here is yeah, the news. Yeah. Jaya, Jaya. Yeah. It's <laughs> giving me a flower. Yeah. Oops. Here we go. A little flower for you. Um, yeah, God, God, sense of humor. What are you talking about? Um, well, here's the thing. When you do something that is inappropriate for a religion or for any practice, the ones who get offended are people. It's systems. It's traditions. God, the absolute. Yeah. Yeah. Get offended. Right. Um, how does it work exactly? How does this thing there, which contains everything, gets offended by my actions? Ah, that's funny. That's that's an interesting thought. So there is a God is everything, right? And and there is this thing in creation which is called sense of humor, which is this isolated little bubble that is not part of creation or not part of what uh, God can conceive. Give me a break, okay? It's like this this little ant. Right, imagine that we are God and then there's little ant, which is a human being, and the little ant goes like And we as human beings we go like Wow, I really don't like what you're saying to me right now. I feel really hurt by your words and what is coming out of your your heart and your little being. Alright? Yeah, that makes total sense. Um Anyway, I, I believe that God has sense of humor and that everything is part of creation, so let's play. I'll see you soon.